SS TV. Building a scout mentality. We are also having uh, a project called Dignity for Girls. And the, the, the course has also started. That seminar is for scout leaders. And then they will teach the boys and the girls uh, how to handle health related issues that affect both girls and the boys. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, we are here at Kazi National Campsite. All of the scouts from the various uh, districts of Uganda are here. But they have come along with their leaders. All scouts that are coming to Kazi must have both male and female leaders. The female leaders look after the female scouts in their respective camps. And the boys are looked after by the male leaders or teachers in their respective camps. Now, the scouts, as we have seen, the younger scouts are having activities both competitive and those who are undergoing training and others sports and games. So at Uganda Scout Association, we also have a project that is in partnership with other organization called the Faith in Water, and it is called Dignity for Girls. We are training them on menstrual health and management. This is for scout leaders and scouts. And as a national executive commissioner, I'm here uh, to invite the project coordinator, Haji Musana Sulaiman, who is coordinating this project on behalf of Uganda Scout Association. You're welcome, sir. Thank you, sir. Barane. Tell us what is going on here. Yeah, uh, what is about this program? There was a partnership with uh, our friends from the UK. They are called Faith in Water, headed by Susie Weldon and Mary. That was 2018, training our young girls, especially the younger teenagers, because there was a research by Ministry of Education of Uganda that most of our girls, they leave out schools because of not the proper management of what? This, this program. Uh, uh, therefore, there, that partnership, we came up with a badge on MHM. Okay? Uh, and uh, since then, it was because of COVID, but then uh, in this camp, which we are waking up, our scouts being a national camp, our friends through their partners in Uganda called Arocha and here Uganda, uh, and also in partnership with the, another another group, friends which are yet you are going to hear from our sister, our sister Patra. It is intended to train our scout leaders and the scouts how to manage where they are periods, how to make it reusable parts and also using available materials. So we have come up with this badge called D4G or Digital for Girls and for the juniors whom we are going to train, those who will do better to understand it, to manage it well, they will be given what we call Professor's badge which is uh, a badge on Digital for Girls or for MHM. Briefly, that is the program, and now we are training 50 scout leaders coming yeah. from all over the country yeah. as a pilot project to go down because, as I've already mentioned, Ministry of Education with the research in 2018, they came up knowing so many of our girls, especially in the upper country, up, I mean in rural areas, they are not even able to have these central parties for these girls. That's why, as a scout project, to make them how to make reusable parties, manage well. We also train both male and female. For the boys to tell them that, you know, this is a natural, uh, it's normal, and it's God's creation, and all of us went through that period. Therefore, if you say, one of your sister at the school, she's in this such a situation, your, your work is to help and support her. And also, as parents, we intend to think that this one is for the mothers. When you go to school, we think this is for senior what? ladies. But we are all concerned as parents, in fact as a father, when I'm making a budget for my daughters, I should identify to the, what? to the mother. I should also know and be part of it. Briefly, this is the program going on. Thank you, uh, thank you so much. <laughs> uh, the scouts are busy and also the leaders that came are going back when they are better than they came. Here is our swimming pool. We also have a sports arena. 
the sports activities are going on. We also have the wood badge training for the readers who are going to train the younger ones in various districts. This is the elephant patrol. We are very happy to be here for wood badge, which is upgrading. We have been assistant scout leaders from our various districts in Uganda. We are very happy to converge here for this wonderful training to improve the skills and the standard of scouting in our young youths in the country. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir.